What's up everybody, my name is Andreas, and today's video, I'm just gonna make a little bit short video today. And yes, I am actually in a house car thing, not a house trail, but a house car. What I'm gonna, camping car or whatever I'm gonna call it. And at my parents actually. And just for fun, we did a little bit of barbecue and met my real cousins though. And my young cousins, very good kids, stuff. And uh, whatsoever, so what can I do today? You're probably having reading my title right now or my new board or something like that. And uh, you probably have, well, as I said, mentioned, um, you're probably having reading um, this name of this video. And it was actually meant, okay, but it was actually meant to do this video as like at least a day or two days after I bought my board or at least even an unboxing video but unfortunately I wasn't no I think like hmm nah it's feeling better to actually first test around the board himself and then I can actually explain like right now I actually can explain for example how it's feeling and um, stuff like that so first we actually I can actually will explain I'm actually so First of all, how it so it feels actually pretty good. I mean, it don't feel bad. I mean, actually pre feels pretty good. Not really bad. I actually feel really good. Actually, really good. Actually, even better than longboard. Oh, wait, but a longboard though. How will say this? I feel more safer though on a longboard when I'm going for the downhills. And but wait, what is kind of board? So probably remember uh, last time, I think, I don't know which kind of video, uh, it was a video at least that I actually explained, first of all, I broke my board, I crashed and stuff like that shit, and then I explained my cousin, and then I just argumented, and then I did a talk about my cousin, and now me and my cousin, we hate each other, basically. But hey, I, this is not a video I'm gonna talk, and I promised you people, I'm not gonna talk about my cousin or Juicy Juice Box, I'm not gonna talk about him anymore, and so on. So, whatsoever, that's gone, gone, gone. So, whatsoever, what I'm gonna do, so I'm gonna, so it feels good, but this one, it's not a penny board, it's not a skateboard, it's not a long board, it's actually a nickel board. Wait, what is nickel board? If you don't know what a nickel board is, it's actually basically a kind of like a penny board, but just a little bit slight bigger. That it's just as bigger than a penny board, and a penny board is basically made of plastic. Which meanwhile, a nickel board, like I have here on the side, uh, is made of wood, and it's actually a nickel board. Even it's bigger than a penny board, but it's shorter than a skateboard. If we explain, I'm gonna show you. You're gonna probably recognize the actual shape if you're looking. So here it is. Especially on the nose, you recognize it very simple. This is a simple one. I don't really like it. Unfortunately though, you can see here that because I'm naughty naughty and do actual tricks already on a new board. I'm really good to damage in the board though. But I have been writing a lot right now. And I like this design here. But unfortunately, you can see uh, it kind of tearing down a little bit, kind of because of my foot or what I'm gonna. Oh, I actually, if I think correctly, I'm actually damaging here a kind of a little side sometimes, just because I'm placing my foot on the kicktail though. But hey, I mean, if it is so, I remove this and putting a real good grip tape if I really want. But it's a very good simple one, and I really like a little bit with the design, and and especially I like. Like blue color here, but then it splits to wooden color, and that I actually like. But even with the, you maybe don't see. If I go like a little bit, yeah. Now you can see probably the warp logo. I think I'm, uh, so they did laser cut kind of like that, or laser mark that, being the warp logo. So what that? But what even love that I never seen. Like literally, almost never seeing on grip tape at all, at least when I'm buying actually. So I bought this completely in whole set, 
and if you're buying one really recommend loose it up the, at least the nuts and bolts every single nuts and stuff and then put it back for your hand because it's being actually better than basically for the wheels for an example they're actually using like a machine and it's not really good and stuff like that it can actually damage your bearings and stuff like that uh, the only thing though you don't need to disassemble you can disassemble everything if you want that I actually did on the trucks because then I can get my, get my own custom settings and stuff like that for how tight and loose and stuff like that and I really like it uh, but on, the only thing one thing I do not like it it just the trucks though and the main reason I don't like the trucks it's standard type I mean it's nothing wrong it's not ugly I don't li hate it like that but I don't the only thing one thing I do not like it I mean it's not like stupid it's definitely not I'm, I am a skate nerd and stuff like that but the thing is basically do that I kind of don't like it eh, because it's less stable and uh, the difference with, between this one and a real longboard truck a longboard truck actually are more stable and for a fact you longer di between a distance between these trucks you're more stable than it's being even with this regular ones stuff like that shit but whatsoever so that's done talking about the board itself though as I said I love the, I love the design and um, I love the shape I love the model I love almost typically everything of it I even love the length it's so perfect length and perfectly do it's like how I say it's kind of a typical trick I actually mostly using it kind of like pumping so actually getting speed kind of and don't need to kick it's very fun though sometimes but I even do manual and it's very fun very simple actually more simple to do a nickel board than on a long board or even a skateboard <clears throat> sorry um yeah okay some people is outdoor here I don't know but hey whatsoever but sorry for the quality though and um, yeah and but that was all like I basically gonna talk about but wait how much did I pay in it so here's the last thing so I paid it $41 but in the normal plot normal price it would be 71 US dollar but it, obviously I didn't pay it in US dollar though I actually paid it here in Swedish money which is 400 though and then it should be 600 though and so on whatsoever but that's all for today's video and I don't think I can do it like I do not know if I cannot do if I have something else to mention or talk about or anything I don't think about that but or no I actually have like that but I do one thing actually though it is I have a little project that I'm gonna do on my board uh, which kind of project so I'm gonna do so I can actually my trucks longer distance away each other with made of with a plank so it's being as I said more stable but even using my longer trucks and stuff like that but I'm gonna make another video to explain that actually and obviously doing a how-to video and how I'm I gonna do this project and stuff like that and as I mentioned in the previous video I think it was I said I actually gonna do I would say a surprise project or something like that shit but yeah whatsoever I actually gonna go sleep and stuff and I'm gonna upload this video tomorrow actually it's better so I'm technically all the way home then or even home already when I'm actually uploading this video but hey what's over so thanks for watching this video click on the like button and subscribe for more videos if you want remember only if you want that's one thing important for me at least that if you want but hey whatever but we will see you soon stay tuned for the next video.